Hi, Joe Forrester here for We Love Sport at the Redback in Fulham, a pub that I'm sure is going to become synonymous with Chelsea fans. And let me tell you, Frank Lampard's men are in scintillating form, having won seven out of seven in all competitions. They face Manchester United tonight in the League Cup, hoping to get some revenge for that 4-0 defeat on the first day of the Premier League season. Let's find out what Blues fans think of Frank. Super impressed. Lots of young players being played by him. Going well. I think, given the uncertainty around Hazard leaving and I guess Louise and I guess the youth coming through, yeah, a bit of a bit of a surprise, but yeah, enjoying it so far. I know it's, it's been our problem we've been begging for for years and years, hasn't it? Every Chelsea fan's been wanting to see him come through. Um, we've had great kids for a while. We've won everything at a young age for so so long. Uh, but to actually see them given a chance, uh, playing consistently is like, you know, without Frank, I'm not sure what would happen. Uh, he's doing a really good job this season. I mean, at the start of the season, the expectations weren't that high. But going on game by game, youngsters are doing really, really good for the team. Like players like Tammy Abraham banging goals in the Premier League. It wasn't to be expected coming off from the Championship to get to that Premier League level, but he's doing well. Now, I'm not actually surprised because you know Frank Lampard's always because he was he was Chelsea captain for a bit, so I knew that obviously Team Shield was going to be a good thing. Like, like to Mason Mount and Tammy Abraham, he was always going to get them going. So I think he's done really well. I mean, when a new manager comes in, it's kind of hard to maybe sort of get going. But the fact that he sort of trusted all the youth guys, like getting Tammy Abraham, Mason Mount. I mean, I don't even support Chelsea, but you can't help but admire it. Build slowly, do a little bit this year, and then go on next year and, and, and consolidate. If Lampard gets top four and gets, I'd say, to the quarter-final, semi-final Champions League, I'll be happy with that. I'll be extremely happy with that. I think if Chelsea finish top four, it will be immense. Because Liverpool are playing so well this season. Leicester as well, uh, they've got a great system going. Uh, United are, are pretty cat, to be honest. So uh, if they get top four, it'll be brilliant. But I think what, what matters most to a fan is actually watching your club develop. And I think like taking one step forward and seeing all these young guys play for Chelsea, man, that would just make any Chelsea Chelsea fan like feel so warm, you know? Uh, I think it's got to be top four, but even if he doesn't, um, hopefully he's already got enough credit in the bank with, with Roman, but we all know what Roman's like, right? He can wield the ax. Um, his hand's kind of been forced this year, but I think top four and just keep on doing what he's doing with the kids and you know, the fans are really behind him. I think coming into the season, kind of top six, and all right, cup run would have been happy with. Given where we are now, I think top four is kind of realistic game, especially with Tottenham and United having a few struggles. So, yeah, kind of going for that top four. And if we could get a cup on the side, it's always nice. Well, I think it's, it's just one of those things we see how we go. At the moment, we're doing pretty well. Top, top four at the moment, can't complain. I think we can aim for top four, but anywhere between the top six is good enough. Mason Mount, because um, obviously, and Abraham, but obviously he can chose England and from what a game I watched, he did step up for England against Bulgaria, so, so like, that's, I think Mason Mount's really impressed me. I mean, just even, okay, if you've got sort of a local lad from Chelsea playing, that's great, but even just having young English talent is brilliant for your average English fan, because, you know, we've got the Euros coming up in 2020, and having Mason Mount get that game time, Tammy get that game time, tomorrow, you know, it's just, it's great, because it looks like we're developing a really good squad. All the fans have been looking for get this youth system through year on year on year but all we've done is just spend money on players that, that don't really care about the club you know what i mean so to get these players in that care about the club that have got that winning mentality for the youth is, is pretty key to the club um i well i having been chelsea guy and you know looking at our kids for years and just uh, hoping they'll be given a chance um i always kind of knew mount was a great player and did really well at the test and then derby last season but i was just surprised by how good is how good his vision is this year i didn't think he was going to be that that good at this level and um you know he's just playing amazing amazing uh absolutely once again yes they will yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> the tottenham river uh hoping top four but with uh the troubles of spurs and united i'll probably go for third <laughs> above tottenham and arsenal correct um yes i do i think they're struggling massively um Solskjaer, obviously an absolute legend but i don't know never gonna fill the boots of fergie is he 
Uh, I think Spurs at the moment, you say yes, above Spurs, um, maybe above Arsenal. I mean, it's early days, like a couple of injuries to that front four and you don't know what happens, but I think you sneak into the top four, definitely. So unsurprisingly, Chelsea fans in confident mood here this evening ahead of their game against Manchester United in the League Cup. Don't forget, for football opinions from all over the UK, make sure you stick with us here at We Love Sport. We'll see you next time on Pub Pundits. Do make sure to check out our social channels as well, and we will see you next time.